Bright ones for there. Because even though it's an old diamond, it's alright. It's a little bit bobbly, wibbly bobbly. Mm. But it looks right. But it's not. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. We're back with the Lister again. The kit has arrived. Look. I don't show my address. Look, the kit. The kit has arrived. So we have uh, seals and things. And Sean has descended upon the engine, or Shunty Bunty, as he's now officially called, has descended on the engine now. So let's see if we can get this thing going. You'll notice his personalised registration number in the background. So if you'd like to uh, look that up. Ironically, <laughs> it's not even personal. It's I actually bought the car. With that on it? And it no, that, that's the actual reg of the car. It was only afterwards. I went, hang on a minute. Well, I wasn't, I I wasn't going to say anything, but it looks more like Sinead <laughs> than Sean. Well, really. the, the 5 5.8 resembles 5.8, which is my favourite train. And it basically says, Sean H, because obviously H is my second name. So if we ignore the D... It's great. Who lost you? There you go. As per usual. Right, this might take a little bit of lid. Have you put have you put seals in that? Yes. And I've always put a little one drum on the Hooray! Yes. I just hope it's not the car. If it is the car, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna kill myself because I'll have to spend another two hundred quid. Well, no, I think the car will all, all, all right. We don't need you. Uh, we don't need you. We do need you, but we're not putting you on. We're not needing you. Oh, it's still coming out. It's coming out already. Turn the fuel off! Bollocks. I mean, I've adjusted that, so it's, this is, I think this is gonna take quite a few attempts, but we can try. We can try. Hi, Mrs. Sean. Hello. Cracking. <laughs> Oh, I don't know though. It's not as bad. Oh, it might have been. That might have literally been what was left in the top. Let's see. Uh. <laughs> no. Yeah, but it's not, it wasn't coming out the top though, like it was. Should really put gloves on for this because fuel is bad for eczema. See, I reckon we'd adjusted it wrong because it was quite obviously hitting the top and not closing at the bottom. Yeah. Because the float was too high, maybe. Yeah. Right. Yeah, that was probably it. I think at first it was too low, and then when I got it to run for the best part of 20 seconds, I adjusted it too high, and then that's why we couldn't. Just, I know someone's going to mention it, right? I know. Yeah, I know. There's no, there's not a lot of water in there, but it's only because well, there's no point really. Don't get a girlfriend if you have an interest in engines. Don't get a girlfriend, <laughs> just. No. They're now throwing fuel at each other. Oh, it it just puts fuel on our relationship. It ignites the spark. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> right. Here we go, viewers. Left. <laughs> no. More adjustment. It's actually all coming out of the boiler. Where, what is it? Uh, so we can put the wrong one on there. Maybe they should be tighter. Yes. Tighter yeah. is good. That's good to know. 
Right, it's uh, now dark because there was a bit of a distraction and we ended up going for lunch. We're not sponsored by them. No, wish please, I was. If you see this video, Taco please Bell. Do. Taco Bell. Um, yeah, so the flow, right? I don't know if you can see that. A little tiny hole that grips the needle. Or it's supposed to, we don't think it was, and that's why it wasn't sealing and the um, fuel was getting in and flooding it. So we've, uh, Sean has adjusted that now. So hopefully that's going to work. And if it doesn't, then I'm going to have to, well, I don't know, to be honest, I might have to order a whole new caboodle for it. Unless one of you wonderful, lovely people like us have a lot of stuff in the garage and you go oh i've got this thing here that i don't know what it is yeah if anyone's got one if you see this like in your random drawer of batteries yeah. and stuff go yeah. no I'm comment below it. please give it to us and in return we shall return this random bolt which is off an audi a3 uh free of charge so you can go wow i've got a bolt that's entirely put in this but you can you can't, not use it as a <laughs> you can't, however, use this bolt, which is off. Um... Yeah, amongst other things, his garage door don't work properly. Right, adjustments have been made. Once again, Taco Bell's repeating badly. <laughs> oh no, Sean, stop. Too much. It's going to be one of those things, this is going to be mysteriously unfixable. Do you know what I mean? Oh god. But we will now find out if this is probably a major fire risk now considering the entire engine is doused in petrol. Let's find my bottle of water. Bottle of water! The uh, approved fire extinguisher. <laughs> yes, because that will save us all, won't it? Not even trying. You know what this calls for? Bonfire. Alcohol. Beer. Alcohol. <laughs> Alcohol. It's not even kicking. I don't know how we managed to get it to just tickle itself last time. So I was just about to record an outro, but Sean has insisted that he's not giving up. Mrs. Sean's going to go up on here now. And uh, Mrs. Sean, aka Pearson, go on, Pearson. is uh, going to start the engine. Some and if you start this now, first go, I'm going home. We must honourably... Oh, 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 oh. Can I just say how dodgy this looks from over here? No, it could look worse. <laughs> <laughs> no, we didn't. We knew it wasn't. Not even coughing now. Mm. Yes, you see, that's, that's where the very wet to be that's fair. where the spark plug was. Um, it's now completely flooded. Um, I blame you. I blame you. Oh, you! I can blame you as well. I blame Pearson. It's all Pearson's fault. It's all I'm going on the technics. Of course we are. Okay, uh, so we've tried again. Uh, we've failed again. So I think, to be honest, 
it's now new carb, new float, um, and just a whole new engine to be honest. But I'm, we're going to do that in spring because what we're finding out today, like I got here at 2, 2 p.m. and then by the time we've had lunch and got back it's dark and we just can't see anything. So it's going to be a job for spring. So um, thanks for watching, hope you've enjoyed it. Like and subscribe and all that stuff and uh, to play us out, here is Sean. Thank you.